All right. Essentially time to go in another vacation. Let's go. So our baggages are ready, even the emotional ones. Everything is prepared for a new adventure. Now we do have to catch our flight. So we'll see you at the airport. And after that, at the location, of course, let's go. have arrived in the most anticipated Valencia or how we like to call it Valenciaga so we wanted to come here since the pandemic even before and we finally reached this destination I look so sleepy because I just took a big nap because uh, yeah long flight and long airport wait so today we're just gonna visit a little bit around here and then you know the next days will be the like the big visits so let's get this stuff started We stop by for a little coffee. I'll see what voice isolation this new mic offers because it's super loud in the city center. This is a pretty nice place, although you know they don't really understand English, but I guess that's like a given. So, yeah, we're gonna get a little coffee break. We ordered some tapas here, and then we're gonna get to a nice steakhouse tonight for our first day in Valencia, you know, like a celebration. It is not so freaking cold outside. It's pretty good today. So yeah, last night we went at the steakhouse. It was pretty amazing, pretty tasty, but a lot of food. We had to split it. Not that great of a service, but amazing food. Now today we're gonna go to Bio Park, which is essentially a zoo, but animals like walk freely. They're not caged. So for us gamers, it's like an open world zoo, you might say. Let's get to the park. What you doing? Now where else would you have a coffee view like this? Super awesome, right? Oh boy, you're so cute. You're so sleepy. I am too tall for this. Oh, this is huge. Damn. This is what I wanted to see. Rhinos, dude. Bio Park finished. And now we stop by in the city center for a quick cerveza. It is a bit windy in here. That's why we keep our hoodies up. Although it wasn't that windy in the Bio Park. I don't know if I can show you the city center. Dude, I look like the Michelin Man. <laughs> Good morning. We just woke up having a little bit of coffee. Today is the big day of Oceanographic. So yeah, in about an hour and a half, we're gonna have to be there finishing my coffee. I gotta say, Bio Park was actually awesome. It's very well taken care of and it's worth every penny. That ticket is worth every penny. And the interesting fact is that many animals, many species live with other species without bothering each other, basically, which I found pretty amazing. Anyway, let's head up to the next place. Chin chin. We are here. And we already see the jellyfish in here. I think they're kind of scared of the rain. So that's why they don't really <laughs> get naughty here. This is a big dude. Insanely big jellyfish. I 
I think this is a fish of the dark parts of the sea or the ocean. I don't think we're gonna see any <laughs> here. Apparently, the ocean. And I believe this is an actual shark. Perspective, dude. Like, right over your head, see? I actually stopped for a small coffee before continuing the visitations. It is pretty cool so far, it's just that um, it rains a lot. I think we have crocodiles next. Oh, and we can see, I think, whales and dolphins, which is the next exciting part. So yeah, cheers. Also, my, my hair is a freaking mess. <laughs> Finally out. <laughs> Is he gonna jump? <laughs> so this concludes our visit at the Oceanographic. Beautiful place. I enjoyed the visit. The sun is gonna be in my face now. Next we're gonna have to go to the Museum of Science. Can't wait to see what's there. Earth as we know it, beautiful and spinning. We just got out of the Museum of Science because it's closing time right now. I am very tired, but the museum was awesome as you've seen. Time to get something to eat and drink because I'm tired and hungry. We finally got to the restaurant. We're gonna have a beer, some 10 days old chips, like my girlfriend says. <laughs> and a sangria, obviously, so let's freaking cheers. Cheers. Now that we're gonna get some coffee in our system, we are ready for the next day of the hemispheric. I actually missed the first movie because I required some sleep. But that's okay, we'll get the next one. I don't think I can film in there because it's technically an IMAX, but uh, I could film the outside of it anyways. So yeah, today we're gonna head off to the Hemispheric, which is in the same place as the Museum of Science. So that's the only visitation for today. So I think it's gonna be a more chill day. So let's do it. Arrived again at the City of Science. It starts raining again. I'm gonna miss the even the 4 p.m. movie because you free now drivers need to get your shit together because everyone is canceling no one no one wants to pick up a ride regular taxis are actually the better choice here so yeah i'm gonna head up to it uh, but i need something to eat but i spotted something this place has oh ho, ho, a mac cafe here it is boys this one right here this is it apparently i got the burger here so right in the hemispheric i mean we went with the fries we went with the burger donut Coke Zero, obviously. And I think I'm gonna catch the 6 p.m. one, uh, which is great because it's Secrets of the Universe, so it's gonna be awesome. Movie ended. I would give it a 10 out of 10. It was amazing. The secrets of the universe, starting from like way back to the Big Bang until today, exploring a lot of ideas of why we're here in the universe and stuff. So it was pretty enjoyable. Dude, but that hemisphere just like gave me like dizziness because you, you're like watching it from a sphere and you're just like sitting on your back with some weird headphones that you have to use as a crown because those translate to English, Italian or other languages because the whole movie is dubbed in Spanish. Overall an amazing experience. This concludes the day of exploration of the hemispheric. We stopped by to the Antonio Manuel having basically a cerveza and something to eat. It is March and we get to see the sea. 
don't know why, but I just couldn't believe it until I saw it. Okay, last meal in Valencia, a cerveza, and I'll see you guys back home. Cheers.